Welcome back to another edition of Colonel's Corner. Today I'm joined by Wilkes women's ice hockey forward Rissa Brazo, who was recently selected as the Colonel of the Week for her play in Friday's 4-2 win over Albertus Magnus. Rissa, thanks for joining the program and congrats on the award. Thanks for having me. Now you had two goals, including the game winner on four shots, as well as winning six face-offs on Friday. So just what was going right out there that allowed you to be such, such an offensive threat? Um, really just the strong communication throughout um, the team that day was really nice. Um, and our energy to always just bounce back in games was really nice knowing that we always keep our head up and no matter how the play's going so far, we're always going to be there and come back. Now you're the fourth women's ice hockey player to win the Colonel of the Week this, se this season. So just what does it mean to you to win this award? Um, it's such an honor because we're such a, a great team as a whole. And there's so many other great players out there that it's nice to be one. On Saturday, the team clinched their first playoff berth in program history. How special is it to be heading to the postseason, especially in your first season as at Wilkes? Um, it's great. Um, I know that's been uh, Coach Lewis' plan uh, this entire season, uh, just to even clinch a playoff spot. And it feels really nice to be in that spot now and just keep that energy going throughout the rest of the season. Speaking of keeping the energy going, the, t the team is currently riding a six-game win streak, which is also the longest in program history. So what will it take to keep that streak going against Hilbert this weekend? Uh, strong energy throughout the core would be really, uh, really important. And just communication and just having fun out there and being there for each other to support one another and get through those two games. The Wilkes women's ice hockey team takes on Hilbert College for a two-game series at the Toyota Sportsplex on Friday and Saturday. Puck drop against the Hawks for game one is set for 5 p.m. Rissa, thanks again for joining us today, and good luck on Friday. Thank you.